everybody, what is up? It's Eddie Neddy and welcome to a very interesting video for you guys here. We are doing players that have never played in the Premier League. How are they going to do? So you might think this could be overpowered, but if you think about it, some of the best players in the world do play in the Premier League. So these guys have that no Premier League experience whatsoever. So you're probably thinking, Modric? Play for Spurs. You know, obviously, no Harlings, obviously, play for Man City. Uh, so, we saw that, obviously, Neuer, never playing in the Premier League. We've got Neuer from Bayern, De Ligt from Bayern, Skriniar from Inter, Marquinhos from PSG, Messi from PSG, De Jong from Barcelona, Kimmich from uh, Bayern, Cruz, Real Madrid, Neymar, PSG, Mbappe, PSG, Benzema, Real Madrid, Oblak, Atletico Madrid, Alaba, Real Madrid, Coman, Bayern, Pellegrini, Roma, Teo Hernandez, uh, AC Milan, Kostic, Juventus, Diaby, uh, Bayer Leverkusen, Vinic Jr., Real Madrid, Bastoni, Inter, Pedri, Barcelona, Tonali, AC Milan, Lewa, Barcelona, Bellingham, even though Bellingham has obviously played in the English League, obviously playing for Birmingham, the team I support, but he's never played in the Premier League, and uh, Immobile, um, Lazio. So, what we're going to do, we're going to get into a Premier League season. Let me know what you guys think we're going to finish. We should be hopefully winning the Premier League. Uh, but yeah, let me know your guys' predictions in the comments. And hopefully, we can do one. If you're wondering why I'm doing this with Millwall, no bit of any fun. Millwall have never played in the Premier League before. Let's see how they're going to do here with the uh, players that have never played in the Premier League. Suits them. Okay, so just to go through things very quickly with um, all of you, we have decided to uh, remove Bournemouth because they're the lowest rated Premier League squad statistically. So, and also what I do do, I try and um, disable the transfer window as well because we obviously, we want to keep it more to real life. Um, well, not more to real life, but you know, more like of... I don't know, more of like a true test of the Premier League versus, you know, the... Um, you know, versus the non-Premier League players. So let's get into it. And if anybody is new around here, please like, subscribe. That would mean a lot. So we're at the first game of the season. Let's get into it. Brentford away. I'm going to show you guys all the important games and pretty much most of the games. I'm going to win 4-0. Messi, Benzema, Marquinhos and Mbappe. Great start. Probably got our biggest rivals in this save. We're going to be taking on Manchester City at home. Fingers crossed. Come on, can we stay strong at the den? We actually lose 2-1. Haaland... And Foden. It's a bit of a shock, that. Here okay, we now got Arsenal at home. How are we going to do here? Come on, let's see if we can win. And we do narrowly, but we still do win. Neymar and Mbappe. I really am interested to see who will be our top goal scorer this season as well. He needs to be fairly spread out. Liverpool away. How are we going to do against Liverpool? Hope we can pick up a win. And we actually lose 2-1. I think mean, this going to be a lot more tricky than I think you guys anticipated. Okay, we have now got Tottenham at home. How are we going to do versus the Spurs? And we actually draw 1-1. Harry Kane, Neymar's goal, chalked off by a late goal from Harry Kane. Got Manchester United away. Going to be a tough game at Old Trafford. They do still have Cristiano Ronaldo in this save. So, it's going to be interesting. We actually draw 2-2. Two -two, and it is Ronaldo which gets the late equaliser. A point away at Old Trafford. Okay, Chelsea at home. Let's go and take on Chelsea. How are we going to do here? And we win 3-1. Neymar, Benzema and Benzema. Big three-point right there. We've now got Everton at home. How are we going to do versus the mighty old Everton? How are we going to do? We actually draw 1-1. Dominic Cover loot with the equaliser. Mbappe with our goal. And they even got a player sent off. Fair play. We have now got the Hammers, West Ham away. How are we going to do here in London? And we actually win 3-2. Messi, Mbappe and Benzema. Them two are better in a absolute race for the Golden Boot. Leeds United away from home. Let's go and take on Leeds. Leeds versus Millwall. And we draw 2-2. Aronson for late equaliser. Wow. Fair play. Got Leicester City. At home, got to be winning this, and we win 3-0. Pellegrini, Neymar, and Kimmich. Big dub. Okay, we now got Manchester City away in the reverse fixture. Come on, lads, come on, we need to win. 3-0 loss, really? Really? We now got Southampton at home. Unfortunately, though, Kimmich is suspended, so we're going to have to make a quick change here. Uh, we'll bring in Tenali, why not? Yeah, bring it to Ali. Right, come on then. Let's go and take on Southampton at home. Uh, oh my days, we lose 2 0. What? 
<laughs> Nottingham Forest away. Easy win. Three points. Boom. Yes. Oh, Benzema and Mbappe, but too close for my liking as well. Crystal Palace. Come on. Come on. Let's get back to back wins. Yes. 2 0. De Litt and De Jong, the Dutchmen linking up. Okay, so we do the semi finals of the FA Cup here against Everton. Let's go and see how we are going to fare. And we win 2 0. Komen and Benzema are into the final. Hopefully, we can at least win some silverware. Here we go. Manchester United, Wembley, FA Cup final. How are we going to do? We win 2-0. We win the FA Cup. Kimmich and Lionel Messi. Right, final game of the Premier League season. Newcastle away. Let's go take them on. How are we going to do? We win 2-0. Mbappe and Mbappe. Now, let's go and see where we finish in the Premier League. Good stuff. We didn't get relegated. It was Southampton, Leeds and Brentford. I would also love to see about, like, taking away, like, I want to see how he's going to do some of the best teams in the world as well. So, we're going to have a look at the Champions League, like, you know, CL, Real Madrid, Bayern Munich, you know, them all teams getting on. Okay, we actually finished quite low. We actually finished ninth, I know. We scored 61 goals. Mad. But we really did struggle to just, I don't know, just wait to inconsistent. 17 wins, but 10 draws and 11 losses is just unacceptable. We weren't miles off away from, you know, the top five, uh, the top six, sorry, only a few points off, but we just done awfully. Man City dominated the Prem again, so it didn't look like we made much of an impact towards the top six, really. However, we did win the FA Cup. Now, let's go and have a look at the Carabao Cup. I know we did make it far in the Carabao Cup. We got lost in the semi-finals against Liverpool. In the Champions League, it was a Man City and Real Madrid final, so it didn't affect them too much, really. Uh, let's go look at the group, see if it affected Ajax, fell out, but there was nobody we really got from Ajax. And let's go, Madrid, I think, oh, black, <laughs> definitely affected them, they were down to fourth. Uh, Bayern Munich didn't make it, I wonder if we affected them, uh, by taking away, you know, Komen and, uh, Kimmich, Neuer, um, anybody else that might have been affected, um, uh, not really, uh, Dortmund, did we take, we took Bellingham off Dortmund. Um, and, yeah, not really much, too much affected to us. What about in the Europa League? The Europa League, Club Bruges and Fenerbahce. United lost. That is mad. Right, yeah, I'd never get really affected, uh, the European teams. But anyway, hope you got... Oh, no, we're going to check through the players' stats. We're going to check through the players' stats. Right, let's go to the squad hub. So, Oblak, 20 games, 4 clean sheets. Neuer, 30 games, 1 assist. Nice. 6 clean sheets. Tony only played 7 games. Lit played 38. Skriniar, 39. Marquinhos, 48. Yeah, fairly fair. Fairly fair. <laughs> Kostic played quite a lot of games, 36. Petri, Petri only played 19. Bellingham only played 3. That's the problem with simulating them. They don't always play as many games you would like them to. Neymar only played 21 games, but only got 5 goals. Cone played 38. Vinny only played three games. Messi only played 23. Benzema, 48, 15 goals. Mbappe, 49 games, 27 goals. Mbappe has gone down to 82. Lewa only played four games, scoring once. But anyway, hope you guys have enjoyed this video. You guys have. Make sure to like, subscribe. See you soon. Take care.